It's time now for my alternative news headlines. And let's start with some wonderful wedding news. The 85-year-old former Italian prime minister, billionaire entrepreneur Silvio Berlusconi, has found love and will marry his 32-year-old girlfriend. That's right, 32. There is a 53-year age gap. But, of course, age is just a number. Well, here on Mark Dolan tonight, we've gained exclusive access to a leaked copy of the wedding list. It includes Last of the Summer Wine on VHS, a family pack of Werther's Originals, all we loves to suck on something at night, his and hers stair lifts, very comfortable, early bird vouchers for the Toby Carvery, oh, I love my turkey, and last but not least, front row tickets to the bingo. Happy days, two fat ladies. The American model Bella Hadid has revealed that she had a nose job at the age of 14. She said that she had the operation because she felt like the ugly sister compared to her older sibling, Gigi. Well, in another exclusive for the show, we've managed to track down before and after photos of the nose operation. No one knows how we got hold of these. So this is what she looks like right now after the op. Fabulous looking lady. And here is the before. Crumbs. Back to nature. David Cameron is in the news. The former prime minister is going to drive all the way to Poland to help out with the relief efforts in Ukraine. Nice to see Britain sending the Ukrainian people a useful tool. Let's take another look at some of those before and after photos of Bella Hadid. Here's what she looks like right now. Fabulous. Excellent nose. Lovely shape. And before the operation, space age. I think she forgot her uh, mascara. Harry and Meghan are also in the news. They're being lined up to present the Best Picture Oscar next week. They'll fit in well, given their own fabulous acting in the Oprah interview, for which they should have won an Oscar themselves. Now let's go back to Bella Hadid one last time. Excellent features. What a bone structure. That was before the op. And after... Not for the faint-hearted. Look at that. That was a makeup-free Monday. I have those every day. And those are your alternative news headlines.